Just a quick one guys, before we do get into today's video, we do have brand new designs available on our website, so go check out the collection. We've got the Gaza playing the flute, and we've also got one for Ali McCoy. As I said, if you do want to buy them, do go down into the link in the description, or go to rfcclothing.com. Anyway, let's get into today's video. And hello everybody, welcome back to the channel guys. Before we do get into today's video, as always, please do smash that like button and subscribe to the channel for daily Rangers content. Okay, so this weekend there is no football for Rangers for the first time in what feels like a long time. Obviously the end of the season is here. The transfer window isn't yet open, so we're in this sort of lull period for the next sort of, or just under two weeks until the window opens, until stuff actually starts to sort of gather traction. However, there was some football being played yesterday, and that was down in the second tier of French football. Obviously, Bordeaux missed out on promotion to the uh, to Ligue 1, um, and as I say, we'll be playing their football in Ligue 2 going into next season. Now, you might be asking me, why the hell does this have anything to do with Rangers? Well... Josh Mayer is a target for Rangers and has have, there's been reports over the last couple of weeks slash months that Rangers were interested in his situation and wanted to bring the striker to Ibrox. However, there was a sort of clause that if he doesn't get promoted to the top flight of French football this season, then he will be available for free this summer. Bordeaux have missed out on promotion and will be spending next season in the second tier of French football. And that now means that Josh Mayer will be available for free. Interesting, interesting stuff there. The player did win the Ligue 2 team of the season, was in the Ligue 2 team of the season. Also got 16 goals, six assists in France's second tier and is a player in the position that Michael Beale wants. Now, obviously there's nothing really here just yet, just obviously the news that he is going to be available for free. So we're probably going to start to see things heat up as uh, Josh Mayer's future does uh, get resolved this summer. But it does look like he will be leaving on a free transfer out of France this summer. And Rangers, as I said, are one of the clubs that are heavily interested in in the player, which is uh, really, really exciting stuff because I think this is look like a player that I can get behind. And I think he is a player uh, that would excite a lot of fans. Obviously, he came through um, the ranks in England. He was born in England, played in the sort of Championship League One, all the rest of it, notably with uh, Sunderland, uh, before making a move to France. And as I said, he's had a fantastic campaign. Um, this year with Bordeaux, uh, was on loan with Stoke last season as well, but he's had a fantastic campaign with Bordeaux this season. However, it does look as though he will be leaving on a free this summer. Uh, that's all I've really got for you today, guys. There's not much on the Rangers front today apart from that. Um, so do let me know your thoughts on Josh Mayer's situation. And is he a player that you would like to see Rangers go out and get now he's going to be available on a free transfer? Let me know your thoughts down there in the comment section below. That brings us to the end of today's video. As always, please do smash that like button and subscribe to the channel for daily Rangers content. Remember, we have got a new collection available on our website, so do browse it. The Ali McCoy's McEwen Lager t-shirt along with the Gaza playing the flute tee. Go down into the link in the description or go to rscclothing.com and get one there. Thank you and I'll see you all next time. Take care. Peace.